Hello and welcome back to HWRadio.com. You're here with your main man, Hollywood, and the other female MCs. I got a word of advice for you. <laughs> you can't beat them, you better join them. Because motherfucking Cardi B, I told y'all about la- earlier, last year, last year sometime, the Cardi B was here to stay. And this right here just solidified it. And shit, I think even the Beehive better watch out. So, Beyonce and her fans, y'all better watch out now because there's a new a new sheriff in town. And she's a female sheriff. But here goes the story. Grammy, Remy Ma and Lil' Kim, others celebrate Cardi B's historic win. Acclaimed female rappers Remy Ma and Lil' Kim have joined fans and other celebrities to celebrate Cardi B's historic Grammy win. News agency of Nigeria, NAN, reports that Cardi B on Sunday night became the first solo female rapper to win the Grammy for Best Rap Album at the 61st Ceremony. Leading the celebrations, Lil' Kim tweeted at, at Lil' Kim, thank you Jesus, look at God, congratulations boo, at Cardi B, you deserve it, so happy for you, Grammys, hashtag Grammys. Also, rappy Remy Ma tweeted at Remy Ma, yes, Car- at Cardi B. I mean, at I am Cardi B, congratulations, babes. And Iggy Azalea joined the trail of congratulations on Twitter through her handle, at Iggy Azalea. She wrote, whoa, at I am Cardi B1, super happy to see a female rapper win a Grammy. You dominated 2018. And she, she's speaking facts right there. And writer Jamel Hill tweeted, Cardi B truly represents the American dream. Think about where she was six or seven years ago. And now she's won a Grammy biopic material. Music producer DJ Khaled tweeted at DJ Khaled, congrats at I Am Cardi B, well deserved. NAN reports that Cardi B won the award, which is her first Grammy for Invasion of Privacy. Lauren Hill was the last woman to win the award over 20 years ago with the Fugees. While accepting the award, she appreciated her husband, Offset, and his Migo and his Migos group, and all the artists featured on the album for their support. The Bodak Yellow singer also recounted the difficulties she faced recording the album while pregnant with her daughter, Couture. Damn, she motherfucking put out another hit, and they thought she was going to be a one-hit wonder while she was pregnant. She doing motherfucking LeBron James shit in the music industry, <laughs> but let me go back to the story and appreciate it her team for inspiring her to finish the album. Cardi B shared the Grammy with Mac Miller, the young rapper who died in 2018 and was also nominated in the same Best Album category. She said this later on her Instagram page with a video of herself thanking people for their support. She said, I read an article that Mac Miller's family said that if he don't win, they want me to win. So I'm sharing this Grammy with you. Rest in peace. And damn, man. Like... And then she's just so fucking real. She's real. Her music's good. She's real. The music's real. And, you know, she's been herself. Something that's hard for a lot of people to be. And that's why I told y'all she's going to be number one. For the simple fact that people love her and it's not fake or phony. It's her really being her. So, uh, you can try to part ways with her if you want to. She's going to definitely get picked up by the next motherfucking company. And that's that's a fact. Because <laughs> you got her back. Like, NeNe Leakes, you know, she used to get, I think, about a million. But now she's down to 200,000. Cardi B's up there about to take that damn spot. And uh, Nicki Minaj, she, you might as well just sit on back now. Because with this, with this Grammy right here, you heard what it said. The first female since Lauryn Hill 20 years ago for best rap album. Meaning she she took out the niggas too. Let's not just say that she beat the women, motherfucker. You gotta you gotta put the you gotta put it all on there, man. Put everything on that motherfucker. This is a supreme nigga. She beat the niggas too. And I want y'all to know that. That's best rap album. Not best female rap album. <laughs> Best rap album. So yeah, she was right. She dominated. Who was that that said that? Iggy Azalea. Iggy Azalea was right when she said that you dominated motherfucking 2018. So congratulations to you, Cardi B. 
I know that uh, some of my shows done gave you hell and some of them done bigged you up. But on all in all, all I can say is is that everybody's going to have something to say about you. But 360, you a good person because I can see that you you actually are a good woman. You give every every other nigga that attitude, but you don't give your man the attitude. You treat your man like a king. And I can't do nothing but respect a woman that does that because that's hard to find nowadays. These women taking your attitude that you give the other niggas and they take that and give it to their man. <laughs> but I think you just need to open up a class and kind of teach them. But that's the benefit of having one of them Dominican, Puerto Rican women because they basically was raised that way. But that's going to be the show for today, so make sure you go over to hwlradio.com, download the radio station app, make sure you check out the sponsors page, and shit, I'm out.